Let's talk about Amazon things, TikTok made me buy, and if they're worth it or not, part one. The first is this phone stand, and 100% yes, this is a staple in my daily routine. You can charge your phone on the stand, and you can also adjust it upwards or downwards, just depending on what you like. Then we have this carousel, which I personally use for skincare, and I love this. It holds so much product, you guys, so if you're a skincare makeup junkie, definitely get this. It also looks really good on top of my desk. Last up is something I surprisingly didn't like. It's supposed to be a facial mister, but I don't know if you guys can tell, it is so weak. I much prefer this one, which is a little bit pricier, but look at how continuous the mist is. If you guys like these videos, definitely let me know. I can do more of them. All the links will be in my bio. All right, guys, here's part two of things TikTok made me buy from Amazon. I got these S hooks, which are perfect for hanging up your jeans. It just makes it look so much more neater and way easier to pick out your outfit in the morning. Then I got these hair clips, which are perfect for getting your hair out of your face when you're doing your makeup. And the best part is they don't leave dents in your hair. Then, of course, the famous hair dry brush. It does have three different heat settings. And I've heard mixed reviews about this. You have to make sure your hair is damp, not wet when you do this. And please, if you have this, use heat protectant on your hair. I have heard that this damages your hair but I've also heard that it does wonders. I just sectioned mine into two and did rolling motions towards the end of my hair to give it a little bit more volume and dimension, and this is how it turned out. Then I got drawer organizers and marble contact paper to organize my drawers. Everything looked so much better and more neater, and it was way easier to get ready. Then I got the stackable pink jewelry Things TikTok made me buy that I love. These acrylic pen holders. You can also use these for makeup brushes. These white gel pens. They write so nicely. I use them every single day. This oil spray dispenser. I love this. We have not bought cooking spray since. It works so well. This concrete soap dish. This mini trash can that fits in your cup holder. I love it. As you can see, mine is super full. Be sure to like and follow for more. Things TikTok made me buy, part 9. I saw makeup artists wearing these headbands while doing their makeup. I wanted to try one out because my hair is always in my face while applying my makeup. They're super soft and cute and now I won't be bothered by all that hair. Things TikTok made me buy, this glass tumbler from Amazon. Here's what it looks like out of the box. It comes with two straws, a clear and a white. It's actually really nice quality for only $13.99 and it's so cute. Things that TikTok made me buy for my room. I love it. Things TikTok made me buy, part 31. I've been seeing everyone on TikTok having a hamster and I really wanted one too. I made sure to get her a big cage so that she feels comfortable and has enough space to run around. I will be adding more things within the week so hit the like button for part 2. Random things from Amazon that just make sense. This electric lighter is so you never run out of fluid, you just charge it when it's done. This fabric shaver is magic. It will quickly remove any pillage that you have piled up on your clothes. This sealer will seal shut any bag that you have to keep it fresh. And this ice tray will literally give you diamond-shaped ice, because why not? Things TikTok made me buy, part one. This is seriously the most high-tech ear cleaner. It has a camera on the tip, which allows you to see inside of your ear while you're cleaning. It's really gross, but also satisfying. Things TikTok made me buy off Amazon, part two. This Tinico eye floor complete. Let me show you two reasons why I had to have this. Reason one, reason two. This is after using it for 10 minutes. What is the best product that TikTok made you buy? This may look just like a regular shower head, right? Wrong! I bought this shower head a few months ago, and this shit increases the f out of your water pressure. Here's what my current shower hood looks like. Wow, oh, that's your ass. Not bad. Now let's put this on. Shower head is installed. Damn, bro. That's my target, boss. Right there, bro. Come on, let's go. Come on. Woo! Oh, that, that thing right there. Oh, look at this, bro. It's crazy. It's so literally hurt you. <laughs> now you guys see why this is the best product we purchased through TikTok. We got a weapon slash shower head. 
Look at what TikTok made me buy. Only my fingerprints unlock my door. Things that TikTok made me buy. So the very first thing is this portable protein powder funnel. These cute tank tops. A scalp massager for your shampoo. Also this mouthwash. The ordinary peeling solution along with the other ordinary stuff. This polygel nail kit. The Essence Brow Mascara. A color changing lip balm along with the Ulta lip glosses. These sweater combs. And this right here is the best thing I've ever invested in. It's a literal tray for your car. If you get anything, get this. What is something that TikTok made you impulse buy? I'll go first. <laughs> Y'all, I bought a crystal pee pee in Tiger's Eye. Like, not just that though. My keys are super lit. I bought this too. Behind every bad bitch is a car seat. Like, how lit are both of these? I am dead. This is this is actually way bigger than I thought it was gonna be. It's pretty big. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm gonna tag these businesses below. Y'all check them out and let me duet this and let me see what y'all bought this week because TikTok has to be stopped. Like, things TikTok made me buy that I love part two this USB rechargeable lighter, extra cup holders for your car because you can never have too many, the scalp massager that we leave in our shower. The skylight that transforms your room into a night sky. This is Luke's favorite thing. And last but not least, backlighting for your TV. Be sure to find me on Instagram and like and follow for more. This is what TikTok made me buy. This thing sanitizes your toothbrushes in just five minutes. It holds up to six toothbrushes at the same time. It even comes with a toothpaste dispenser. Before. After. This is a game changer. TikTok made me buy it. Makes everything for our small business look so much cuter. TikTok made me buy it. Chop, chop. Open up myth. Ooh woo. Pop pop pop. Time to pick one. This one. Yes, queen. Look at that. Ten a ten. Wanted to show you guys this thing that TikTok made me buy. Literally, I cannot live without it. This is a TikTok tripod and it's basically a tripod for your phone. I got it from Amazon and it comes with a Bluetooth remote so you can take your own pictures. Honey, we taking our own pictures in 2021. Um, you can change the orientation from portrait to landscape. However you film, it's extendable up to a couple of feet and it fits inside my bag so i can take it wherever i want i just love this thing i've been using it non-stop tiktok made me buy it and now you're going to give it to the first order the first order rose from the dark side you i'll show you the dark side i've been going a little wild on amazon truly ordering the most unnecessary thing i Absolutely did not need this. So clearly it's a cherry, right? No, bitch. This is a toilet bowl cleaner. This is the cutest thing to scrub my shit. I told my boyfriend, we're not using this to scrub the toilet. This is for aesthetics only. I love pink. I love strawberries. And I love stuffed animals. So when I saw this little fucker, I knew I knew I had to buy him. Okay, to me, this is a little bougie, but this is is absolutely worth it. I don't remember the price exactly, but this is a little bit more than I would typically spend on a body spray. I promise you, if you wanna spend a little bit extra than like you would at Victoria's Secret, buy this and you're gonna smell like an angel goddess. I saw this lip product and I didn't even think twice. First of all, the packaging is so freaking cute. Sometimes my hoarder side comes out and I wanna save the packaging. Does anybody else do that? This is a Laneige lip 
balm. It's in the scent Gummy Bear. These are pink marble koozies specifically for your Starbucks drink. The small one will fit a tall, the medium will fit a grande, and the large one will fit a venti. I have an iPhone 13 and it is always dying. This is an option that I got to keep in my wallet. First of all, it's pink. Second of all, it is tiny. It's super thin so you can keep it in your wallet as if it's like a credit card. And bitch, this charges your phone. It's like something so practical, so necessary, but so cute. Go to part two. All right, y'all. Here's some things TikTok made me buy. And this is gonna have to be a part one because I literally spent so much money. All right, starting off, I got these headbands. They were like $10 for eight of them, like $1.25 each. And I used them to do my makeup or wash my face. And then I got this makeup bag because it was just so much more organized because mine was so messy. Oh, God damn. So I just organized it into little compartments here. And those can move too, depending on how much makeup we have. And then I got this little steamer because I had some shirts that needed some help. Look at that one. Woo! And it literally heated up in like 60 seconds. All right, and then I bought this slit remover because I bought some leggings from a bitch that did not take care of them. So I just cleaned them all up and they looked brand new again. Look at all that. Ugh. Then I got this phone stand because I like to watch videos and listen to music while I get ready. It was super easy to assemble and it even tilts. And it's just super pretty, like for part two.